Hey everyone, I thought I would show you the 2020 Revel that I have for sale. It's time for it to find a new home. Uh, the windshield wipers have been lifted up because we had a little bit of an ice storm here in Seattle. So I just want to make sure I'm taking great care of it. This thing is like brand new. It's got very low miles on it, about 29,000 miles on it. And it's got some really great upgrades. So I thought I just would take you through it so you could see it. Um, this thing uh, really needs to be used and uh, it's fun, fun, fun. Uh, van in fact i wish i would have used it more but i just don't and it needs to go to a good okay for starters let's look at the outside so as you notice here it's got an awning that's up at the top it also has this door nice little key fob here you'll notice if i hold this button down on the key fob what's great is the door opens now in the 2020 the unique thing is this look i can pull it and actually stop the door which is something that's kind of interesting a lot of them don't do this and watch i can just pull it again here we go and now you notice it's going to shut right so 2020 did that again i'm just going to pull it now it's going to open up the other cool thing about this is that inside here if you look there's a button right here if you can see it it's right back here behind the seat that is the button that i can push that button and you'll notice it also closes the door so that's kind of a cool feature as well okay let's go up top so you notice the back here we've got uh, the ladder also got the trailer hitch so if we go up the ladder i'm going to show you what it looks like up at the top and you can see the solar panels and the air okay let's take a look at the back and this is called a garage i'm just going to open this up so if you look inside here, uh, this, this thing's like brand new. And so this is a really great upgrade right here uh, that allows you to have a bench and underneath here is storage and also a swivel table that swivels out. You'll notice over here on this side, we've got the straps. These are uh, the thermal um, window coverings. So in the winter time and even when you're camping, you put those up, you've got your slider here and then you've got your two uh, headboards right there. For the bed that automatically comes down. The other nice thing is it has the roll F screen back here. It unzips and rolls all the way down that then turns into a screen mesh window as well. It makes it really nice. You also notice here, you've got uh, some storage in the doors. And the new thing is if you want to shower in the back, take a look at this. There's a connection right here with a quick release and there's your water pump. And there's also a side light on the outside. So pretty unique pretty great uh, that was an upgrade that was done to this okay year. so now I'm inside and just a couple things I want to show you so you notice the seats right here we do have covers on the seats these are leather seats underneath and you can see the cockpit here uh, I do like the drop down armrest they go all the way down come back up lift them all the way up uh, you do if you go notice up here you also have storage up above so this is great storage it's here you also have storage pockets here and storage pockets here and so it makes it really nice uh, when you're traveling to be able to put stuff away and stow it. While okay, now moving back, you'll notice there's a bench seat right here. So this bench seat will sit too. It also has seat belts. Another nice thing is over here, you'll notice that this little piece pops out like this. And this actually, if you look underneath here, it actually folds down. And when that folds down, you can turn this actually into a bed. And so this is in the 2020s is when they still had a bed that came across here. As well. Okay, here's your electrical panel to show you this right here. So as you notice here, you've got... Uh, up at the top here, this is works the, the bed in the back, and I'll show you that in a minute. This is your heater. Here's all your switches for the function. Here's your lights. Here's your inverter. Here's your water heater. Right here is uh, showing you what the battery capacity is. And then over here, we have the tank levels and the battery levels and the water pump levels. So you've got quite a few cool little things here on this panel right here, and that sits right above the bench area. Uh, so it makes it really accessible. One neat thing here, this used to be a key. Now I can hit the button right there like that. And you've got up and down. So just notice if you hit the down button, you'll see as the bed comes down, it's very easy to do. And this allows the bed to go back up. And then you simply hit the button and turn it off if you like. Makes it pretty okay, easy. the restroom. So we do right here, you've got a door. It's going to open this up. And you'll notice in here, what you'll notice is uh, there is a toilet. You can see down there, there's the toilet right there. And it goes into a cassette that's on the outside. Uh, this also is a shower as well, so you notice at the top you've got your disconnect quick release shower. You also have a shower rod, you also have a vent at the top. And over here is where you'd store your toiletries that go in there, and these shelves pop out uh, and make it really nice. Uh, you also could put some uh, storage here if you'd like. Uh, haven't done that, but I've seen people that have done those types of things. And the door just simply shuts, and there's a lock right up here at the top, and just locks it. So you're good. Okay, let's talk about the bed. So I'm going to run the bed down a little bit here so you guys can see what happens here. So it's again gonna run this uh run this little button down you'll see the beds going down let's get the lights on back there okay the lights on the back and so you'll notice back here in the bed this is a brand new uh, foam mattress it also has the foley sleep system that's been installed which makes it really nice this comes down actually goes down a lot lower than this uh, there's storage pockets here and then there's lights over here and you simply can come over here click light lights come on 
All right, very easy to do. Uh, you also have a light switch that's out down here on the side. I'm not down enough, low enough for you to see it, but there's a light switch that you can turn on that will turn. There you go, lights on back here. There you go, okay, there we go. And then you also have an air conditioning unit right here <clears throat> and a heater, and you have your smoke alarm. Pretty cool little deal. Comfortable to sleep. It's got the push outs on either side so you can sleep. I'm 6'1". I fit comfortably across. Okay, there is a pantry. I'm gonna open the pantry up. You'll notice in here there is a pantry. As you can see, we've got some lights in there. So this little unit actually sticks right up here on top. Let's put that back up there. It's got a little uh, Velcro adapter. There we go. That just makes it sit up there. And as this opens up, it's motion action. So the lights go on. And it's got the push button lock that's on there. Also, you've got up here storage. Again, with a push button lock. Kind of neat. All right. Okay, I'm up top. I just came up this ladder. As you can see, let me show you the ladder right here. It just hooks on the back. I'm going to spin this around so you can see there's the air conditioning unit right here. And you notice the two um, solar panels that are right there. And so this thing can go off grid. You'll also notice right here is you have, you have your awning. And that is an automatic awning uh, that just has a button. It goes out. It also has a wind sensor on it. So if it gets really windy, it'll, it'll retract itself. And it's got some really cool LED lights on it. Okay, one of the other cool things is this table right here. You notice this is a drop-down table right here. It's got a strap flip these up and it drops down and then the strap holds it at an angle also right down here you'll notice that you've got your uh, your tank fill you got your tank drain and you got your winterizing tool here and if you come around this way you'll also notice here you've got a uh, tank fill here you've got your lower lights you've got your uh, coach batteries so batteries on or off you got your awning out awning in and out and then down here you've got another little step light that's right there makes it kind of nice uh, for just really okay easy. I'm sitting here I want to show you Here's the cockpit up here. You'll see this chair right here. These chairs totally swivel all the way around. So now you've got them facing this way. And the nice thing is once that chair is totally swiveled and this one can do the same thing, then you've got a table down here. This table down here just simply pops up and now you've got a table. So if you're sitting in this chair right here and it's swiveled around, you've got a place where you can sit, do work, do whatever you want to do. And these slide back and forth. Again, these are seat covers. They are leather under. Okay, let's talk about these windows. So one thing, uh, they all come with these. These are the, the thermal uh, coverings for the windows. They fold up, they go above there in the storage area. And notice right above me, there's one for this thing. Uh, there's also one for a window over here. But you'll notice these windows kind of unique about these windows. One is they simply unhook here and the window opens out. Uh, and then you can set that, uh, shut that back up. Once those windows are shut, uh, the other thing is there's a, there's a shade. So I can, from the bottom, I can pull up and that is a shade, push that back down. Or from the top, I can pull down and that is a screen. Kind of makes it nice. And then, like I said, these then fit back in there uh, for uh, covering them up just to give you a little bit more heat in the event that you're out somewhere where it's cool. Okay, let's talk about the dash. Here I am, you just see them in the cockpit. And it's very, very simple to start it. You simply just hold down on the button and it fires up just like that. You've got all your controls on the steering wheel right here. You've got a really great navigation system right here uh, with all the other uh, cool things. It's got all the bells and whistles. So uh, the distance uh, cruise control between vehicles, uh, the notifying you when you go off lane, thing of that nature. Up here, you've got your lights, right? So you've got all your light systems that are up here. Uh, that you can push on you oh i don't do nope do not want to call sorry there we go there's my lights turn all those on turn those off okay pretty cool on how that works uh you've got right here you've got your um very very easy oh, in that call don't want, there we go uh you've got sunglasses you got your visor that pops down right here you got some storage up here as well so it makes it pretty nice. Uh, you've got all of your tools on here. You also have the, the side mirrors that actually fold in with a push button, just like that. You go back out, very easy to do. You've got some good side storage pockets right here. Uh, pretty unique. Pretty okay, cool. let's take a look at the kitchen here. So I'm just gonna show you the kitchen. So here you notice you'll have, you have your sink, right? Pops up like this. You've got your controls right here. Uh, you also have the button right here that runs the, the the sink drain runs that out you've got a, a cooktop stove here you've got some storage right here down below you'll notice you've got a refrigerator right so you got a full refrigerator that's right there uh you also down here have three drawers that open up that you have and they have the push buttons that open up just like that very simple you also have a power outlet here power outlet here there's your drain pump right there uh, you also up above have some storage up above here push button storage opens up pretty easy you got your uh, paper towel rack 
right here, paper towel rack right there. You also have this mesh screen that goes across here, plus this drops down and this is magnetized. So if this door is fully open like it is now, you can still be looking out. This also comes off, so it makes it kind of unique. You also have a pantry. So if we open up the pantry, now let's push the button right there, the pantry. There you go, there's your pantry. Uh, shut that back. Makes it nice when you're traveling and you got a lot of space. One of the things too is on the cooktop, I wanna show you this too, is that if you want more counter space, it simply pops up and now you've got more counter space right here on your cooktop. So that makes it nice if you're wanting to cut stuff or have stuff here prepping when you're making a meal. You also have a table on the outside right out here that folds down as well that you can use uh, if you wanna do some outside cooking. All right. Hey everyone, thanks for watching the little tour of the Sprinter Rebel 2020. Uh, if you're interested in this vehicle, let me know. It also has a really nice lithium battery upgrade. Also has a diesel furnace heater uh, and some other uh, cool things that came with it that we'll also throw in, such as the power. You see the power cord back there. It's plugged in right now. And some other nice things that come with it as well in terms of uh, winter blankets that go over the windows and the openings and things of that nature. If you're interested, just reach out to me. That is Fanning, F-A-N-N-I-N-G, at Windermere, W-I-N-D-E-R-M-E-R-E.com. I'd be happy to answer any other questions you have. All right, everybody. Hey, have a great day.